Hello guys, in this video I'm gonna show you how to modify your mouse button control to actually put short court key of a command in AutoCAD directly on the mouse so you don't have to, uh, to do extra movement. So I found this site that show four programs that are totally free. I'm currently using this mouse major the first one it's very simple uh, if you have more than two extra buttons I will not consider you to install it but it's a pretty simple program if you don't wanna put much effort into it well there's Hydra mouse who is pretty more complicated as you can see there um, yeah, I tried this one too, and uh, I will not consider to to make you install it because it's not very uh, user friendly. And uh, this one I did not. So if you want to take a look, I'll put the link in the description below. And uh, there we go. We're gonna start. Uh, gonna download Mouse Major. This one. Let's do it. And I already got it. So, you just gotta open it in your desk. It's something like that, it's pretty simple. You got your extra button 1, extra button 2. As myself, is the page, page down or page up. You just gotta verify yourself. So, you just click there and put whatever you want. Control Z as if. There is no short key in AutoCAD that is Control Z and Control F2, F12. Sorry. So I'm just gonna take the M and say uh, save. Then you gotta open AutoCAD. Oh, I already got it. Uh, this one not so tricky. You gotta go to your manage tab and click user interface so we did put there uh, our mouse key to to make control f2 uh, f12 or control z so what we want to do is to modify our shortcut key to put a line or whatever you want you'd have all your comment there that you can have in uh, one mouse button so I did put line, and uh, as my uh, other button, I put the uh, undo, which is there, as Control Z, as you see. So the only thing you got to do is to search for your command line, extrude, whatever you want, and search for it. There you go, and put it in the shortcut key menu right there. As you put it, there's no key axis. You gotta put there key axis F12. They say it's already um, assigned it because I got it right there. Can move this one. So this is it. So as the as I click my extra button for Control F12, it's gonna recognize it as a shortcut key. With a line and those shortcuts, we you always gotta put control before it. If not, it doesn't work. As you see, it's all the shortcut key is there that you can change if you never use it, as I do. I never use it, so you can modify it. You can put all the comments you actually use a lot on it. So. As I do line, I did undo like control Z. Uh, this is it. As you see, there it is. You can put different uh, control key there, but I found that those one didn't enter with uh, the one already there, so I didn't want to mess everything up. So you gotta take Apple. Uh, okay, 
and then you're good to go. Uh, not really. <laughs> Just got a something's wrong there. Control Z. Yeah, this is it. Yeah, it's work. So, as you can see, I do not click any buttons. It's all all on my mouse, and I can do some lines, some construction lines, and the most useful command undo. So I undo everything. I think this is it. So I hope you enjoyed it. I'll make many more videos uh, upcoming soon. Uh, I'll try to start uh, a channel with the tutorials and everything. So leave a like, subscribe. Thank you.